We want to pass along our congratulations to some of our current and former colleagues who were honored at tonight's Mid-Atlantic Emmys. Tonight, Stacy Smith was honored with the Board of Governors Lifetime Achievement Award from the Mid-Atlantic Region of the National Academy of Television Arts and Science. He joins the likes of Fred Rogers and another of our former colleagues, Patrice King Brown, as recipients of that award. In comments recorded for tonight's virtual ceremony, Stacy called it humbling. When I look at the list of previous honorees, it is humbling to be included in the ranks of some of the best talent in television. My first part-time job in broadcasting was at WFMS-FM in Indianapolis in 1967 while I was in college. It was a station that played a lot of Montevani, and I had the opportunity maybe once or twice an hour to give the call letters. But when I turned on that microphone and spoke those call letters, I knew I had found my profession. That part-time job eventually launched a career that began in radio news in Muncie, Indiana, and transitioned into television news at WHAS in Louisville. It was there that I began to learn the intricacies of solid broadcast journalism. It was there where I learned one must have a sense of fairness, a sense of history, and a common sense to be a broadcast journalist. A grasp of those attributes helped to give me a career for which I will forever be grateful. And a congratulations goes out to our colleague Brenda Waters, who was inducted into the Silver Circle for more than 25 years of service in the Mid-Atlantic chapter. Brenda, who was here at KDKA for 37 years, talked about what she is most proud of. I'm most proud of is the Emmy award-winning segment I created called On a Positive Note. This industry has made me... And congratulations going out to our colleagues who took home Emmys tonight. KDKA News, our news director Kathy Hostetter, and the KDKA staff were honored for News Excellence, the third such honor for KDKA since 2015. Megan Schiller and photographer Ian Smith won two awards, one for their story on toxic drinking water, the other for their investigation into which type of mask stops the spread of germs best. KDKA creative director Tina Vion and editor Greg Laskar were honored for their City of Champions promo. From all of us here at KDKA, a big congratulations to all of the winners.